three, two, one, go. All right, Sandstorm's making it very difficult for teams to see on to Planet Primus at the moment. That's not stopping any of these Alliance from successfully placing their hatch panels. 1403's lining themselves up on the side of their cargo ship. One of their cargo just falling out. They have the hatch panel in hand. 222 lining themselves up on the bottom of their Blue Alliance rocket. 747 swiftly making their way across field. Looks like they're going to be playing some defense on this Blue Alliance. 5401 successfully placing their hatch panel on the bottom of their front side rocket. Wasting no time grabbing cargo already. Lining themselves up, successfully scoring it. 222's lining themselves up as well for their third hatch panel, successfully placing it up on the second level. Their alliance, Cougar Robotics, coming up from behind, placing down their cargo into the front side of their cargo ship. 5401 looks like they're placing cargo into their cargo ship. Their alliance over on the other side, 225. Cargo just dropping out. They're going to re-pick it back up. 5401 has another cargo. That makes three in their main area. 222 is lining themselves up. Cargo successfully in the bottom of their rocket. 1403, we got four of their cargo in the main Blue Alliance cargo ship. Man, Tigertron's not wasting any time at all. They're just going back and forth from their loading zone to try to fill up this rocket to the best of their ability. 747, they're not too happy about that. They're going to try to make sure that that doesn't happen. Playing defense on not only 222, looks like they're trying to fight off Cougar Robotics as well. 1401, placing another one of their hatch panels on the front side of the rocket. 225, having a little difficulty on the back side of the field. They have their cargo's falling out. You know what that noise means. 30 seconds. 222 is trying to make their way over to the loading zone. Having a little difficulty. Flight crew getting in the way. 1923, not wasting any time at all. Lining themselves up to get to the top of that hab. 747 swiftly making their way across the field to make sure that they can get on top of their hab as well to match them. This is going to be a very close match with five seconds up. All the Blue Lines robots are up on the hab. But two, one. All right, scores for semifinal four will be here in just a moment. You're on the edge of your seats. The Red Alliance will take the win with a score of 99 to 96. Moving the Red Alliance on to our finals, 1923, 222, 1403. Thank you so much for playing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, in case you missed it on Thursday, Pennsylvania Governor Tom Wolf visit us, visited us here at Lehigh. While he was visiting with teams, mentors, and volunteers, Elizabeth was able to get a few minutes of his time for an interview. Let's check it out. So my name is Elizabeth. I'm here with the governor of Pennsylvania, who's here at the wonderful Mid-Atlantic District Champs. What do you think of the event so far? Well, I think it's amazing. I mean, I, I, the, everybody.